Hey you watching this video, you better like the video in 5 seconds or you will like all day. Yo what is up everybody welcome back to another Warzone video on the channel. And as you can see from the title on today's video I've been bringing you guys the top 5 loadouts in Warzone Season 3. But hey man before we get to the top 5 loadouts for Warzone Season 3 make sure to drop a like in the video, subscribe if you're new and turn on the bell. We're almost to 7,000 subscribers. It would mean a lot if you help me out to reach that goal. But yeah man not if you've done all that let's get to the top 5 loadouts for Warzone Season 3. Alright man, so as you can see, for our first loadout, we have the XM4 and the Cold War MP5. This is one of my favorite loadouts, man. I don't know why, just, I don't know. This is one of my favorite loadouts. I enjoy using it, and I'm really comfortable with it. Alright man, now let's get into the best class setup for the XM4. Alright, so starting with the muscle, we're putting on the edge of the sound suppression, vertical gun control, velocity, and effect damage range. Next up for the barrel, we're putting on the task force barrel for velocity, horizontal recoil control, effect damage range, and vertical recoil control. Next up for the optic, we're putting on the axe drums 3X. Next up for the under barrel, we're putting on the field edge gear for horizontal control and vertical view control and that's that magazine we're putting on the static 60 round and there you go ladies and gentlemen that's the best class setup for the exit 4 for warzone season 3 and now let's get into the best class setup for the cold war mp5 all right man so starting with the muscle we're putting on the edge of sound suppression vertical control velocity and effect damage range next up for the laser we're putting on the s soft stalker designator for effect damage range and hit fire accuracy for the stock we're putting on the no stock for sprint to fire time for the underbill we're putting on the booster grip for wind speed and hit fire accuracy and that's that magazine we're putting on the 750 round drum and there you go man that's the best class setup for the Cobra MP5 for Warzone Season 3. And now let's get into our second loadout. Alright, man, so as you can see on the top left, I had the Car 98, but the Car 98 got nerfed. So I decided to put the Growl. It's still one of the best ARs right now. Um, it's a laser beam. It's, it literally gives you aimbot, okay? It has no recoil. And we're gonna pair it up with the Owen. The Owen is one of the best SMGs right now in Warzone, and it's like top three right now in Warzone Season 3. But yeah, man, now let's get into the best class setup for the Growl. Okay, so starting with the muscle, we're putting on the monolithic suppressive sound suspension and damage range. Next up for the bear, we're putting on the Tempest 26.4 arc angel barrel for damage range velocity and recoil control next up for the laser we're putting on the tag laser for ads speed aiming stability and aim walking steadiness for the underbill we're putting on the commando foot grip for recoil control and aiming stability and last five magazine we're putting on the 60 round mags and there you go man that's the best class setup for the growl and now let's get into the best class setup for the owen all right ladies and gentlemen starting with the muscle we're putting on the recoil booster for fire rates all right next for the bear we're putting on the hawkinson 305 millimeter precision barrel for highly accurate and controllable headshot damage bullet velocity and range for the outfit we're putting on the nidar model for reset Next up for the stock, we're putting on the remove stock for movement speed, ADS speed, sprint to fire speed, and aim walking movement speed. For the underbear, we're putting on the cover for grip for recoil control and hit fire accuracy. Next up for the magazine, we're putting on the 7.62 Garanko 17 round drums for recoil control and accuracy, fire rate. For the ammunition, we're putting on a lengthen for bullet velocity. For the red grip, we're putting on the groove grip for aim walking movement speed, accuracy, ADS fire move speed, and horizontal recoil control. For the perk, we're putting on acrobatic. And last for perk 2, we're putting on fully loaded. And there you go, man. That's the best class setup for the open for War Season 3. And now let's get into our third loadout. Um, as you can see for our third loadout we have the Creek 6 and the Milano. Creek 6 is still one of the top ARs to use right now in Warzone. I know it has a little bit of recoil but it's really easy to control it. Uh, the damage is not as good but it's still really good if you hit all your shots. And the other side the Milano is one of the freaking best SMGs to use right now in Warzone man. I don't know, but for some reason, man, I use this class setup for the Milano. I'd be dropping more than 20 kills every single time. I don't know what's up with that, but I don't know. The Milano is really consistent, and it's one of the best SMGs, in my opinion. But yeah, man, now let's get into the best class setup for the Creek 6. All right, so starting with the muscle, we're putting on the edge of the pressure sound suppression, vertical control, velocity, and effect damage range. Next up for the barrel, we're putting on the CLV mil spec barrel for velocity, horizontal recoil control, effect damage range, and vertical recoil control. For the optic, we're putting on the Axiom 3X. Next up for the under barrel, we're putting on the field edge grip for horizontal recoil control and vertical control and that's about magazine we're putting on the 760 round and there you go man that's the best class setup for the creek sticks for warzone season 3 and now let's get into the best class setup for the milano all right man so sitting with the muscle we're putting on the edge of the press of sound suppression vertical control velocity and effect damage range next up for the bear we're putting on the task force bear for effect damage range velocity and trace speed for the laser we're putting on the amber signing point for effect damage range and hit fire accuracy next for the stock we're putting on the radar stock for ADS fine move speed and walking move speed and sprint to fire time and that's about magazine we're putting on the 755 round drum and there you go ladies and gentlemen that's the best class setup for Milano for Warzone Season 3. And now let's get into our fourth loadout. All right, so for our fourth loadout, we have the SCG-44 paired up with the well gun. The SCG-44 is still one of the best ARs to use running Warzone. Literally has no recoil. Really easy to control it as well. In the other hand, the well gun is literally top three SMG in Warzone right now. It's really overpowered. 
really easy to control the mobility is really good everything is good about this gun but yeah man now let's get into the best gun setup for the stg44 all right so in my opinion the amex silencer is better than the recoil booster but if you want to you can put on the recoil booster fire rates but i use the amex silencer for sound suppression horizontal recoil control vertical recoil control and damage range for the barrel we're using the vdd 760 millimeter 05b barrel for highly accurate and controllable damage range reduced scope sway and gun bob and bullet velocity all right man next up for the optic we're putting on a g16 2.5x for a stock we're putting on the constant tactical stock for aim walking move speed aim walking steadiness and initial fire recoil for the under barrel we're putting on the cover forward grip for recoil control and a fire accuracy for the magazine we're putting on the 7.62 grand code 50 round max for recoil control and accuracy move speed AS speed and fire rate for the ammunition we're putting on the FMJ rounds for bullet penetration. For the red grip, we're putting on the hatch grip for accuracy and horizontal recoil control. For the perk, we're putting on the acrobatic. And lastly, for perk 2, we're putting on fully loaded. And there you go, man. That's the best class setup for the SCG 44 for Warzone Season 3. And now let's get into the best class setup for the well gun. All right, man. Starting with the muscle, we're putting on the recoil booster for fire rate. Next up for the barrel, we're putting on the 320mm SA shrouded barrel for highly accurate and controllable damage range for the resistance and reduced scope sway and gun bob. For the optic, we're putting on the slate reflector. Next up for the stock, we're putting on the remove stock for wind speed sprint to fire speed and ads speed for the under barrel we're putting on the cover forward grip for recoil control and hit fire accuracy for the magazine we're putting on the 7.6 garanko 40 round max for recoil control and accuracy wind speed and fire rate for the ammunition we're putting on lengthen for bullet velocity next for the red grip we're putting on goof grip for aim walking move speed accuracy ads firing move speed and horizontal recoil control and for the perk we're putting on acrobatic and last for perk 2 we're putting on fully loaded and there you go man that's the best class setup for the well gun for warzone season 3 and i'm just getting to our last loadout all right man as you can see this is the modern warfare loadout modern warfare guns do not compete as well as cold war or vanguard weapons but hey you know we had to include the og loadout aka the kilo and the modern warfare mp5 the kilo is still one of the best even though it has a lot of competitors it's still one of the top ars in warzone right now the modern mp5 is not as good as it used to be because it got nerfed but it's still a decent smg to use in warzone but yeah man now let's get into the best class setup for the kilo all right so starting with the muscle we're putting on the monthly suppressor sound suppression and damage range next up for the barrel we're putting on the prowler barrel for damage range velocity and recoil control for the optic we're putting on the v okay optic for the underbar we're putting on the commander for grip for recoil stabilization and aiming stability and last five magazine we're putting on the 60 round max and there you go man that's the best class setup for the kilo and now let's get into the best class setup for the modern warfare mp5 all right so starting with the muscle we're putting on the monthly suppressor with sound suppression and damage range for the stock we're putting on the after collapsible stock for wind speed and ads speed for the underbar we're putting on the mark 4 grip for recoil control and hit fire accuracy next up for the magazine we're putting on the 45 round max and that's your perk we're putting on sleight of hand and there you go man that's the best class setup for the modern warfare mp5 for warzone season 3 and there you go ladies and gentlemen that concludes our top 5 loadouts for warzone season 3 and yeah man check in the comments below i'll be putting some other guns i just don't have them leveled up so i will be adding some guns in the comments below and if y'all want to use them you can use them because they're still really good in warzone even after the updates but yeah man other than that don't forget to drop a like on the video subscribe if you're new and turn on the bell and tell me in the comments below if y'all are enjoying warzone season 3 and yeah, enjoy the top 5 loadouts, have a great rest of your day, enjoy Warzone Season 3, and peace out.